Hi everyone, this is Balwinda. Welcome again, day fourth or year of your FFC challenge. You are just one step away and you are just going to launch your first campaign within a some days, guys. I hope you enjoy the training. Um, in the last video, as I mentioned you about the structure of the campaign, how that's all working. working. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you in this class, I'm going to show you actually how you can create the campaign. If you're on the screen, guys, you will be see here about make sure that you the ad account you created it should be here right um you it should be selected here and you will be come here you just need to press on the button create once that will be press and that will be open here guys this window now i'll show you about this window i'll tell you a little bit about this we have three pillar of the marketing guys if you haven't seen the video i'll just put the down video about the three pillar of marketing where i'm going to show you about the awareness consideration and conversion what that mean is and how it helps but watch the video below and then you will become here and you will be know well about how this works right um I, i'll just give you the basic understanding about this here guys on the awareness campaign you will be have a brand awareness and reach objective guys brand awareness what does it mean in the first pillar brand awareness is guys whenever you launch your new business and you want to aware about the products and you want to launch your product and you know you want that every people will should be aware about your product you can run this campaign in this campaign guys facebook well basically this campaign is absolutely good for the local if you want to be uh promote your product locally and what facebook will do guys in your selected area they will be show your ads again and again again and again so that everyone will be know that it's you launch a new product and they will be remember your name that's the way it mean is brand awareness this is just the main motive is to aware your brand right reach the second means reach the second campaign objective reach guys what does it mean um, in the selected area right whatever the location you will be selected what facebook algorithm will do is they will be reach trying to cover more people at least one time it means that guys the facebook trying to show your ads to the people at least one time and trying to cover more segment right and that will be help you to target more people guys remember one thing the every objective have their own facebook have their own algorithm they works accordingly if you go for the brand awareness they will be show your ads again and again so the people remember your brand right reach awareness is at least one time your ad will be go to a people and facebook trying to cover more people right so at least one time people will see your ads in that way in the second in the consideration part guys the first goal is your traffic right for example guys if you want more traffic if you already have a product you have a good business you want more traffic on the product on that landing page this is the perfect for you right you will be see it here in the eye the same the send people to a website apps on facebook events or let them tap to call you this is the new feature i will be explaining you um by one by one but let me first go through with this all part if you're main goal is to send the traffic send the people onto your website this is the good option for you and second facebook recently add a new option call option so the people will click on the call button they will be direct call to you engagement guys if you want if you have one post on the facebook if you want more like share comments on the post so th this is a strategy it is a part of strategy guys where there will be what we will be do is first whenever we launch a new campaign right first launch our new business and for this business we launch a campaign what we always do first we create a first engagement campaign and where we will be get more likes comment share 
so that other people will think what's going on if they see a lots of comments, a lots of share, a lots of likes on the post. They will be stop and they will be see what's going on here. So this is the basic strategy I will be showing you in the future. But engagement, if you want more like, share, comments on the post, right? App installment, guys. If you guys have any app you want to install, you want the people will install the app. This is the perfect option for you. Video views. If you have the video, right? You want more views on it. This is the perfect campaign for you. Uh, lead generation, guys. This is particularly for the real estate agents. What does it mean, guys? Some real estate agents they do not have website, but they want lead. The Facebook give you their lead form where they have a capability to collect the customer data and then after that they will be called. So Facebook will collect the data for them and they will be give it to you and then they will contact the customer who would like to um, get the service. So this is the best um best campaign best objective for the real estate agent or the people who do not have any form on the website who do not have any source on the website to click that customer data right in the message guys now as you all know that whatsapp and messenger two messaging app owned by facebook so what does it mean guys through this option through this objective you can um, get more messages on the messenger and messages on the whatsapp so that you will be get in touch with your client and you can as we all are on the whatsapp nowadays and you can straight away apply reply to your customer this is the best option for the institute the student want more information they wants to talk with you they that they wants immediately instant reply that will be help you out right in the third pillar Remember, just watch the video below. In the third pillar of the conversion, guys, the conversion, uh, when you want a specific action on your website, that a valuable action that gives you more money, right? So you can select that option, right? So that uh, people will go through with your page and they will be hit the valuable action that you want to take from them right so this is the option if you want any valuable action for example you want to sell something right um catalog sale if you have an e-commerce business right if you have an e-commerce business guys this is the perfect catalog for you where you will be upload a catalog with the old products and then you can run dynamic ads the dynamic ads means guys the people have your product into their add to cart list more than one product two three four five products then what facebook will do they will be run a dynamic ad for you they will be fetch that product from this catalog and that show to the people who already put your product into their add to cart list about the store visit the store visit actually this is the best campaign for the local businesses in their way the facebook have the data when you select that objective then facebook will give your address in the ads and so that the people will just click on your ads and on the address and they will become to your store and facebook will have the data will come in your store how many people visited on your store so basically this is the objective of your businesses you need to not think which what what is your goal which objective it suits to you right as here there's a three pillar actually guys this is the video about the three pillar in the next video i will be show you how you can actually set up the campaigns one by one step right here this is the three pillar which i mentioned you about the awareness consideration and conversion which means whenever you open a new business right you will be running a campaign about the awareness so you want to spread that awareness all over your region or in in your particular location and then people will consider to come on your website or if you open your new shop like right? this is an example and they will come on your shop who consider 
the pro your product that might be helpful for them and then have a look on your product and for example if the hundred visitors come on your website if your traffic is website and then from hundred of people five to ten percent people will buy your product they will actually give you money and that's we call it as an, a conversion right so this is the three pillar guys the brand awareness for awareness then consideration then conversion where you will be get actual money and valuable action that will be help you will be cover your all marketing expense i hope that will be really helpful for you guys this is the ffc challenge guys remember one thing you are just one step away i'm hold your hand and going to teach you each and everything one by one just have a look what is so you just play around it you have a lots of time just spend one to two hours on it and think what's going on behind it in here i will be definitely able to learn this all stuff right so guys see you in the next video where i'm going to hold your hand and do the setup a campaign every one by one and with every single option i hope that will be help you out thank you so much guys thank you so much for watching see you in next video